I am on my way to Kapanda for the Teardrops of SA Autumn Puddle. It's been a while since I've been out in Reggie, so I'm really looking forward to this weekend and simply just getting away. I will uh, let you know how it goes. One of these teardrops. This is a puddle and the weather is beautiful this weekend. So not a bad spot to uh, start your day. Enjoy your morning coffee. Let me keep on the tourist campground. It's lovely here. This weekend in Kapunda, which in itself is an interesting place to visit. Got chalets here, and there's been some local football on. Yeah, it's a very cute place. It's got, got the basics, the camp kitchen, good showers, a bit old, but definitely very good, very powerful in the ladies. Um, it's been fun. I'm gonna go for a ride. It's quite nice around here. I'll do a bit more exploring. But um, I bought my folding e-bike, which I'm really not using, and so I thought I'd give it a go. There was supposed to be a cycle ride here, but apparently it's not finished being built. But I'll go see if I, what I can find. Um, because I haven't used it in a while, putting this back together was um, a bit of a challenge. Good old WD40. Um, has helped me lock it in. So the joint there, which folds the bike, is now finally locked. And um, we'll see how it goes. So it's, uh, it's a really easy bike to use, really, except for the finger braking at that point. You just pull the pedals out. Um, literally just put the seat in. You don't have to take the seat out. But I find it's easier for packing and fitting in the car if you do. And it just slots in and I've marked it to where I need it to go. You can also high and lift the bike stem if you want. And um, then I'll put the battery in. I'll take that out as well because it makes it lighter. It's about 23 or 4 kilos all up. So to pack it away, I just take it out. And uh, you need a key. So there's an added security. So I will then also take a backpack and when I stop, I chain it up, but I take the battery out too because there's no point in having an e-bike without a battery and it costs about $800 to get a new one. Yeah. That is the Nomad.
place you can come and visit the mines at um, Kapunda. Comes with uh, a few warnings. <laughs> um, nice little walk around or a bike ride as I'm doing. And have a look at the little nooks and crannies. It's a nice day for it. place to myself. So it's been quite fun on the bike because I'm getting around quickly and um, I don't have to worry about other pedestrians. It's great. Fabulous. Reggie. 